When you orbit the model, controls for editing vertical curves appear. Point of tangency marks the beginning or end of a vertical curve. This marker is for the high point or low point of the curve. You can see here that we have a crest curve, so this is the high point. Point of vertical intersection marker controls the elevation or station of a PVI. The blue lines indicate the range of movement available within the constraints of this type of road. Use the profile view when you want to look at the road in relation to the existing ground surface. The green line is the existing surface. The black line is the proposed road profile. When you move over a PVI, it is highlighted in the model as well as the profile view. You can adjust the station and the elevation at the same time in this view. Zoom in for a closer view of part of the profile with this slider. You can add and remove PVIs if you need to. The next video in this series shows how you can calculate the optimal vertical path for your road.